B1, video 2, present continuous tense vocabulary in context. Hello everyone, welcome back to our English learning series. Today, we're going to focus on a very useful tense in English, the present continuous tense, and learn five new words that will help you talk about things happening right now or in the near future. Grammar. The present continuous tense is used to talk about actions that are happening right now or temporary situations. For example, I am watching a movie right now. We form the present continuous with am, is, are, verbing. Here are a few examples. Vocabulary. Now let's look at five important words you can use with the present continuous tense. 1. Currently. This means something is happening at the moment. Example, I am currently learning English. 2. Busy. If you're doing a lot of things or working hard, you are busy. Example, I am busy working on a new project. 3. Right now, this phrase means something is happening at this exact moment. Example, she is cooking dinner right now. 4. Project, a task or plan that takes time to complete. Example, he is working on a school project. 5. Tomorrow, this word talks about something that will happen in the future. Example, I am meeting my friend tomorrow. Listening practice. Now, let's use this grammar and vocabulary in a short story. Listen carefully. Right now, Sarah is very busy. She is working on an important project for her company. She is currently writing a report that she needs to finish by the end of the day. She has a meeting with her boss tomorrow, so she is preparing everything she needs. Her phone is ringing, but she is not answering it because she needs to focus. Her colleague is trying to help her, but she is not paying attention to anyone at the moment. While Sarah is working, her team is also having a discussion about the project. They are talking about the final details and are making sure that everything is perfect for the presentation tomorrow. Right now, Sarah is thinking about how she can finish her report on time. She knows that once she finishes this project, she will finally have time to rest. Her team is currently planning to celebrate after they complete the project successfully. Although Sarah is feeling tired, she is looking forward to tomorrow's meeting because she knows it will be a big success. Reading practice. Now let's read the story. After you read it, I will ask you some questions. Right now, Sarah is very busy. She is working on an important project for her company. She is currently writing a report that she needs to finish by the end of the day. She has a meeting with her boss tomorrow, so she is preparing everything she needs. Her phone is ringing, but she is not answering it because she needs to focus. Her colleague is trying to help her, but she is not paying attention to anyone at the moment. While Sarah is working, her team is also having a discussion about the project. They are talking about the final details and are making sure that everything is perfect for the presentation tomorrow. Right now, Sarah is thinking about how she can finish her report on time. She knows that once she finishes this project, she will finally have time to rest. Her team is currently planning to celebrate after they complete the project successfully. Although Sarah is feeling tired, she is looking forward to tomorrow's meeting because she knows it will be a big success. Reading Comprehension and Vocabulary Questions now, let's test your understanding of the story with a few questions. 1. What is Sarah doing right now? 2. Why is Sarah busy? 3. What is happening tomorrow? Is Sarah answering her phone? 5. What are Sarah's colleagues doing? Answer key. The correct answers are...
That's it for today's lesson on the present continuous tense and some useful vocabulary for talking about what's happening right now. Keep practicing and try using these words and grammar in your conversations this week. See you in the next video.